All right, body securely stored. Lacey's ready. Barrel deployed. Visible. What are we doing? We're going to Vision Con. Good morning. Good morning. I'm going to be one of those people. Okay. I want to bet. Thank y'all. I'm going to be one of those people that buzzes your... Can I buy stuff before you start? Before you open? <laughs> So, so, so go, come on. What am I doing? I'm dancing. I don't know what I'm, I'm just kind of awkwardly walking away from a conversation. That's why it's so funny. Hey, what did you find? Games, actually games. Quite a bit of games here. There are a good variety too. Oh, what am I doing? <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, this guy bombed the last time we talked to him, so we're going to let him have another chance. So here we go. <laughs> Hello. Ladies and gentlemen, we do want to thank everyone for coming to VisionCon 2022, day two. We got a few things to let you be aware of today, folks. So, so what's happening right now? Culture Minefield. What's going on? QA with Keith. We'll be at 1230. And make sure to come and get your photo taken. This is Sasha. Okay. <laughs> this is Toyn's art, spelled with it. This is Sasha Kai <laughs> Photography, over in the vendor area. We want to thank you for coming out to VisionCon, day two. Okay, he's done. He said thank you for coming. All right, as fast as can. <laughs> Hello again, guys. This is Toyn's art. Um, I'm most active on Instagram. You can find me at Toyn's Art online. Um, and I post quite regularly and I love what I do. Soon I'll be posting more art tutorials and drawing lessons. So come check me out. Awesome. Quick question. 
I noticed this amazing piece right here in the ears. That's you, right? <laughs> <laughs> my wife inspires a lot of my work. Well, this is a Sonic figure, right? Why is it Egyptian? And if it's not, you have to cut that out. God damn it. <laughs> Dragon Fest is Missouri's fastest growing Renaissance Fair. Uh, we are excited to have full contact jousting again this year. Uh, our vendors are expanding, armored combat. We are really excited to have new royalty this year, which you'll have to watch and see uh, for updates on that coming soon. Um, but family friendly event, lots of vendors, lots of food, lots of entertainment um, in October. And the best place to follow Dragon Fest. Yes, yeah, so you can follow Dragon Fest online at Dragon Fest Renaissance Fair or you can find us online at dragonfest.net. I found plushies. <laughs> uh, well, my name is Adam McLaughlin, so um, I played D&D &D since college and then I just started expanding my hobby list from drawing my characters and drawing my scenarios to building the scenarios. And so, uh, yeah, it's what led me to building things out of foam, 3D printing, and now I'm here at VisionCon selling some of my wares. And these are super light because they are foam. Yeah, oh yeah. Just like I was showing you, you know, these, these houses. That's the one thing, I don't want a super heavy stuff everywhere, so yeah, I want to make stuff out of foam. Gorgeously painted, super detailed, with all the, the extra bits like the moss, the vine. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, as, as realistic as I can get it, essentially, in miniature form. But yeah, my like I said, my players love me, and they love playing in, in the scenarios that, one, I create, but two, I build, so it's really fun. And the best place to find you, you say? Is on Facebook. Facebook. Yep, Adam McLaughlin, M-C-L-A-U-G-H-L-I-N, so... <laughs> Thank you.
we are, Andy and Amy Love, we're the charity managers for VisionCon here. So VisionCon is a charity convention. Nobody here makes a penny that works here uh, for anything that we're doing. So uh, this year's charity is actually Canines for Camo. It's a great local organization. They're based out of Rogersville. And what they do is they rescue a shelter pup. They take that shelter pup to inmates who train the dog, which the inmates now get uh, some rehabilitation and that type of thing. And then that uh, dog is then teamed up with a veteran who has certain needs that a dog can help provide. That dog is then given extra training to meet those needs, then they're teamed up for their forever home. So what we're doing here today is uh, we have all these items that are back here and more are going to come that are going to be raffled off Sunday at our closing ceremonies, which is around 3 o'clock in the afternoon. So we have raffle tickets to sell um, at the $1 level, the $5. And then we have the 50-50, so you get half the pot. And we also have Rampage. They're building a cardboard city over here, Vision City. And on Sunday, someone gets to stomp it yes, and rampage. Just Godzilla so the heck out of it. We have lots, lots of, lots of different ones, and we also are taking flat-out donations if somebody would would prefer that as well. Yep. All right. We're Haven Games. We're a store based out of Nixon, Missouri. We have Facebook, Discord. You can also find all of that on our website, which is haven-games.com. We have demo games that you can try out. Uh, we usually do $5 a game, depending on what it is. Uh, we do a bunch of different events for different card games, like Magic Gathering, Pokemon, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh, and so forth. We also do one-shots for D&D. And if you have a group and you want to set up a campaign, we can set up a campaign on a regular basis. We can schedule it and we can announce it, a bunch of different things. On our Discord, it's a very big community right now that is growing and growing. Right now we have like 150 people and starting to grow even more. And so there we have a large gathering of DMs and GMs and that they get together, they talk about their games and they like to advertise their events and set up at a store. Come see us, we're constantly growing. Um, we just started getting in D&D minis um, and paints and things. I think after that might maybe hopefully be Warhammer. Yeah. So we're, <laughs> there's always something new in the store. All right, and hopefully this is heavily edited. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I'm like, who put him in jail? <laughs> They may suspect him of being a rebel. Did you put him in jail? I, I did not. I'm going to go figure out who arrested my husband. <laughs> I don't have to bail him out, do I? <laughs> hey, John. Nice. Last time I wore this costume. So what did you do to get in here? It wasn't me. There's like, there's like 30 other people that look exactly like me, wearing the same shirt and everything. <laughs> this is a mix-up. I'll be out by lunch. Skeleton Vader. <laughs> There's my darts. I'm going a little crazy.
You can pick him up in five ah. minutes. <laughs> Do you still collect the plushies? Are they very silent? <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, yeah, no way, no way. <laughs> I turned 20 on present, no ain't life without parole. No one could steer me right, but mama tried, mama tried, mama tried to raise me better, but her pleading eye denied. He's only right. the right. Right. wrong guy. Yeah. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. Did you you were, learn your lesson? You did were you gracious hosts. Did you think about what you way, did? Citizen. I I did. I, I thought long and hard. And just to make sure it doesn't happen again, I'm done. <laughs> no more rebel scum, right? <laughs> no more rebel no scum. No more fraternizing with rebel scum. <laughs> very good. <laughs> Uh, hey guys, this is Woody Woodward. I'm here at Vision Con in Springfield, Missouri. I'm a fantasy artist and illustrator. I am building my own world of Avaria. You guys will see uh, some of the work here if you come by booth A9. Uh, I hope to make a book out of it someday. If you want to stop by and talk about what the world is and what it's going to be about, I'd love to talk to you. And uh, if you can find me on social media. Uh, uh, Instagram, you can find me at uh, Woody underscore Woodward dot art. Uh, and Twitter at Woody underscore art. Thanks for stopping by, guys.
I, I like her in her black lingerie better, actually. So. So hi, my name is Patrick Rasmussen. I am an airbrush artist. I'm now pretty much a local airbrush artist in this area. I now live in Arkansas. And this is something I've been doing for over 36 years. And um, I love doing shows, love creating for people, doing different things. Um, a lot of my artwork, actually all of my artwork you see um, hanging up that's in this booth right now are all prints of my originals, but I do sell my originals as well. And um, the, way, the best way to find me is usually at shows. I do post when I'm gonna be at shows. Um, but I do have my website right here. Um, you can order anything online. We ship worldwide. I've shipped across the sea. I've pretty much everywhere. And just love what I do. So it's good. Hey guys, this is uh, Peachy Boy Draws here. I just want to thank you all for coming at VisionCon 2022. It's been a crazy past two years, but it's so great for your guys' support. And if you all wish to find me, uh, you can just find me on Twitter at PickCleverDraws, or you can find me on my coffee page at uh, Peachy Boy Draws as well. Uh, I do a lot of uh, retro anime art of different video game characters, animes, and also I do the OC. And I'm also the creator of Chaser Riley. So if you could, just uh, check out my socials and, uh, and thank you all for your support. Just a girl and her Godzilla. <laughs> Again, question nine. Which accessory of Wonder Woman's allows her to breathe in outer space? And finally, our last question of this panel of trivia. Nick Fury wears an eye patch, obviously. On what eye? Yes. Uh, so Silent Sillies is a uh, comic that I've been doing for 10 years. It's like an old black and white cartoon. They don't talk, it's just slapstick comedy. Um, but one year I decided to uh, do them, make them in color and make them talk and put them in space. And they, um, they interacted with an alien space princess. And I thought it was really fun uh, to maybe explore the space princess story more. But um, I wanted to change up the art style, do a little bit more of an action adventure serial uh, sci-fi fantasy story and so Zamara is the new comic that I've been working on um, and uh, I, I post them online for free um, they're on my patreon in black and white for free but if you subscribe for just a dollar a month you can read them in color uh, three dollars you can um, get them a, a little bit early um, and then the, the story starts out where she's uh, just exploring the planet she just gets kind of tired of the city life basically <laughs> um, and runs into bugs and creatures and and pirates and the pirates chaser and and then there's a sword fight um, which after doing 10 years of slapstick rubber hose art style this was a fun challenge to try to you know get the anatomy right and everything yeah. like that Hey, what else did you find? More games. Japanese games. The blue one like this. I'm the leader now. I got the dark saber. Or do you mean the blue one like this? I'm hungry. Let's go eat. That was a lot of vision con. That was a lot of vision con. That was great. Let's do it again. <laughs>